Hey guys, Demon here to talk to you about what's hot this week. This time we're going to be covering Batman Arkham City, the much anticipated sequel to Batman Arkham Asylum. Now most people are a little bit leery when we're discussing superhero video games. They tend to go through kind of quick, they're a little bit corny, the acting isn't that great. Well this is not the case. This is a superhero game on steroids. The hotkey fighting system makes it easy to play, but at the same time, the amount of combo and points and experience you can gain from one encounter actually will challenge you in different ways. You get to feel and experience what it would be like to enter these battles as Batman as far as what threat or how to assess threats would be the best option for you to handle it with the most experience points, with the highest combos. Anything is possible with this game, and the more you play it, the more you're going to love it. And everyone picks up superhero games thinking, they'll, oh, they'll play it for an hour and they'll put it down. This one gets you coming back for more. All right? Now, if your my word isn't good enough on how good this game is going to be, keep in mind, it scored a perfect 10 in every aspect by Game Informer, and even scored a 9.5 by the Extremely Picky Critics with IGN. This game is an explosive, explosive add-on to the holiday season and definitely a game that you might want to think about checking out. Now most people, again, we talked about it before, superhero videos tend to be kind of quick. Not this game. After you go through the first run-through of the game, you're going to unlock a new, more challenging run-through that your gadgets and all of your experience carry over and you immediately hop back into the story in a more difficult, more challenging way to go ahead and continue to find those ever-eluding Riddler tokens. Now, the thing about that also, if that's not enough on how to keep you interested and expand the life of the game, you also have the option to download the content that you can pay for. This is an option. This is Catwoman. This is the free option that comes with your game. I strongly suggest downloading it before you playing because it will adjust the storyline to incorporate her and it is definitely a fresh change of pace. On top of that, Nightwing and Robin will be available starting the beginning of November. This game will keep you coming back for more. It's graphically beautiful and it sets a new standard for superhero video games. So for the actual lifespan of the game, the extreme fun and addictability of the game, and the fact that it is beautiful with great acting and a fresh storyline, that is what makes Batman Arkham City the hot game of the week. Come join me next week and find out what you should be expecting. This is Damon, and I'm out. Peace.